At the age of 25, Max Verstappen is not only smashing sporting records, but also becoming extremely wealthy as a result of his market value. The Dutch driver is one of the most marketable Formula One drivers. As a result, the Dutchman leads a luxurious way of life. Stay tuned as we take a look into Verstappen's luxurious lifestyle. As a result of Max Verstappen's success over his seven years competing in the highest level of motorsport, he has amassed one of the most considerable fortunes possible for a driver competing in his category. The beginning of Verstappen's rise to fame can be traced back to his childhood. His father, Joss, who competed in Formula One from 1994 to 2003, introduced his son to go-karting at a young age. He also had the required finances and relationships to make it in motorsport. In addition to that, little Max had a lot of speed. The first of Verstappen's victories came in Belgium when he topped a local go-kart series. He went on to win both the European and the World Go-Kart Championships. In 2014, he moved up to Formula 3 category, and just one year later, he was competing in the Formula 1 Championship. When Max Verstappen was just 17 years old, Red Bull Motorsport advisor Helmut Marko offered him a position on the Toro Rosso team, which is Red Bull's development squad. Marko was responsible for bringing the remarkable Dutch talent into Red Bull's Formula 1 program. In the early stages of his Formula 1 career, there were moments when Max Verstappen and his actions on the racetrack caused the Formula 1 world to doubt his talents. Nicky Lauda, a former world champion, had this to say about Max Verstappen's performance at the 2016 Belgium Grand Prix. He belongs back in school. You can't be in Formula 1 driving like that. The Dutchman took out both Ferraris at the beginning of the race in Spa, and then later, to avoid being passed by the faster Kimi Raikkonen, he zigzagged back and forth across the track. But today's Max Verstappen is undoubtedly the best driver on the Formula 1 grid. He has grown immensely over the years. At the age of 18, Verstappen became the youngest driver to win a Grand Prix. Since then, he has gone on to win two F1 World Championships. During this time, he has built up a modest fortune by accruing earnings from salaries, bonuses, and sponsorships. With a comfortable $42.5 million in earnings in 2021, Verstappen was ranked by Forbes as the 27th highest earning sportsman, making him the second best paid Formula One driver in the world behind Lewis Hamilton. As of 2022, his net worth is estimated to be around $200 million. At the age of just 25, he already earns what other athletes of his age can only hope to achieve. Not only is Verstappen one of the wealthiest athletes in the world, but he is also one of the wealthiest athletes in his own country. According to reports, the Red Bull superstar is reportedly one of the 500 richest people in his country. He is the youngest person to appear on that list. It shows that even with at least a decade more in his career, Verstappen is doing wonders for his wealth. You are enjoying this video, right? You definitely don't want to miss out on other amazing videos. So all you have to do is hit the subscription button. It's that easy. Thanks for doing that. Let's move on. At the beginning of the year, Verstappen signed a contract extension with Red Bull for an additional seven years with an annual salary of $50 million before bonuses. In addition, he is one of the most recognizable faces in Formula One racing, which has led to many lucrative sponsorship deals and profits in the millions of dollars. Thus, Max's image often appears in advertisements for jumbo supermarkets, while he is also linked to firms such as Tag Heuer, Zigo, and Exact. As if this were not enough, the young pilot also has agreements with other small companies. However, the exact details of what he earns from these deals are not available. While learning immensely, Verstappen is also not shying away from spoiling himself. The Dutchman travels on his $12 million private jet and has a massive garage of some exclusive, luxurious cars. Let's take a look at how Verstappen spends his wealth. The day after he turned 18, Max Verstappen relocated to Monaco, a city renowned for having some of the most expensive real estate in the world. Despite the recent increase in his earnings, Verstappen is yet to own a property. Instead, he rents a flat with a view of the Mediterranean that costs $16 million. He routinely shares footage of his workouts on the expansive balcony that doubles as his personal gym, and he is occasionally spotted jogging around the exclusive neighborhood. Although far from home, Verstappen is surrounded by friends and family. A good number of his fellow drivers, such as Lewis Hamilton, Daniel Ricciardo, and most recently, Lando Norris, are also proud owners of real estate in Monaco. It shouldn't come as a surprise that Verstappen reportedly drives the best cars both on and off track. Even though he is only 25 years old, he already has an impressive collection of European vehicles that are valued at over $6.4 million. The yellow Renault Clio, which was his first car, was gifted to him by his parents. It was somewhere in the range of $13,000 to $24,000. The first car he bought himself was a Renault RS01, which he purchased for $400,000 in 2015. This was followed by a Porsche 911 GT3 RS, also in the same price range. 
which he gave himself as a reward for winning his maiden race in 2016. Since the beginning of the year 2019, Verstappen has owned a total of four Aston Martins. His first was a DB11, which is the street-approved variant of the DB10 that James Bond drove in Spectre. His second car was a Ferrari. The vehicle includes orange stitching on the seats and orange brake calipers in it, possibly as a tribute to his own country. It is estimated to be worth approximately $205,000. After that, he purchased a 2018 Vantage for the price of $150,000 and a V12-powered DBS Super Leggera for the price of $360,000. Finally, he splurged on the Valkyrie hypercar, which is a cooperation between Aston Martin and Red Bull and is estimated to be worth $2.7 million. So far this F1 season, Red Bull's biggest rivals are the men in red, but Verstappen is more fond of Ferraris off the track. He is the proud owner of a Ferrari 488 Pista, which can reach 100 km per hour in just 2.8 seconds and costs $331,000 as well as an extremely special Ferrari Monza SP2, which is reportedly worth $1.8 million, a Mercedes-Benz C63 SAMG with a price tag of only $78,000 puts the finishing touch on his ever-expanding collection of automobiles manufactured by his competitors. In addition to driving incredibly expensive and quick cars, Verstappen enjoys scooting around Monaco and the paddocks on his scooter. The Xiaomi M365 scooter can reach a top speed of approximately 26 kilometers per hour and can be purchased for a somewhat more reasonable price of between $499 and $599. Verstappen makes the most of his beachfront property by satisfying his urge for speed on the water during his downtime. He can occasionally be seen enjoying the waters of the Mediterranean on his customized Red Bull jet ski. The price tag for a watercraft can range anywhere from $5,700 to $20,000. Verstappen also owns a sim racer in his living room, which nobody is permitted to go near, as he stated during an interview with G-Star Raw. Verstappen has a Playseat F1 Ultimate cockpit, which costs $2,800, a custom-made LM Pro steering wheel by Precision Sim Engineering, which costs $1,800, Heisenfeld Ultimate pedals, which costs $1,100, and Leo Bodnar Sim Steering System, which costs $4,000. The total cost of the installation is anticipated to be anywhere from $15,000 to more than $35,000. Between March and November of 2023, there will be a total of 24 Grand Prix races conducted on five different continents. This makes the Formula One schedule for 2023 the most difficult schedule ever in the history of the sport. This is one of the reasons why the world champion decided to purchase a Dassault Falcon 900EX aircraft from Virgin Galactic. The exterior of the aircraft has been personalized. It has a matte finish, and the Verstappen emblem, which features a lion, is emblazoned on the tail fin. The aircraft was built in 2008 and has a current market worth of over $15 million, with a hefty estimated yearly maintenance cost of more than $1 million. The EX model of the Falcon 900 series is a long-range jet, which is necessary for Formula One drivers to fly across the Atlantic Ocean. The EX model also features an all-glass flight deck a bar, and an optional shower. The cabin, excluding the cockpit, is around 12 meters in length and 1.88 meters in height. It has enough space to accommodate 12 passengers in comfort, although this number can be reduced if the chairs can be converted into beds. Verstappen also reportedly offers Ricardo occasional lifts to and from races because they share the same Monaco building. Even the airplane has its own Twitter fan page these days. There you have it, the luxurious lifestyle of Max Verstappen. What's your thoughts about his meteoric rise to the top of the pinnacle of motorsport racing? Let me know in the comments section below. That will be all for today's video. Thanks for staying tuned. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell so that you can always get to watch more amazing videos like this. See you in the next video.